for Javante, I guess he's fighting Lomachenko. He's fighting Cuero first. I know, but supposedly next fight he's going to face Lomachenko. I don't think that's going to happen. I think... Why not? I don't think so. I think they're going to uh, do negotiations, like they always say, and then say, oh, somebody's asking for too much, and it's not going to happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Build it up. Mayweather did it so you get Javante's name out there again, written about. Smart, good move, but you know what? I see all of it. Yeah. I see all the tricks in the book. I'm not going to fight Lomachenko. i fight some other dude. Which, you don't, he doesn't have to fight any tough fighters right now. Just keep beating up these guys, and there you go. He's going to become a star before he gets to fight them. And you know what? I don't have nothing against them, do you? All right, Coach Henry, May 4th, big fight for the Garcia family. Yeah. The Ryan Garcia show takes place at the Stuff Up Center. Just talk to us about how you're feeling about this opportunity and, and training camp and all that. Well, I feel that our training camp is going really good. Um, you know, we've already uh, started and this is first day sparring, so uh, he looked pretty sharp. I believe that by the time May 4th comes around, we're going to be ready and we're going to be ready for a good, uh, good win. Yeah. How do you feel about his opponent? You're, you're, the, you're the main guy in charge in, in training camp. How do you feel about his opponent, Jason? Well, oh, I mean, I've, I've seen him fight. I've seen him fight. And, um, you know, I mean, he's, he's, he's got skills, you know, but um, one thing about Ryan is that he's got elite skills that people will eventually, or well, if they don't already know, he's going to he's gonna show his, his skills and um, they're going to be beyond this other guy's skill, so I'm not worried about it. Yeah. Okay, Lisa, how do you feel May 4th? How do I feel about yeah, May 4th? Oh, man, I'm so excited. I've been... I can't believe it. It's 75% sold out, so you better get it your is. tickets. Wow. It is. And so That's crazy. I think even more, even more now, because I looked at it this morning and... Uh, I was speaking to Oscar De La Hoya and Robert Garcia. Robert said that Ryan has the, 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 the potential to be the next face of boxing, and Oscar said that Ryan's already a superstar. He expects to sell out. It looks like he's going to be a sellout at the Hope Center. Um, how do you take that positive criticism compared to the negative one, which you've already heard millions of times, but the positive, like Robert and, and Oscar the last Man, I'm starting to see right, that. He is the real deal. I mean, yeah. he's the one that's going to bring in the masses, you yeah, know? Yeah. I mean, we, we love our boxing community and so forth, but to be a superstar, you have to be able to bring in those people that don't even normally watch boxing. That's but true. they are watching boxing now because they want to see who's the kid that's punching and knocking everybody out, right?